So we have this very simple website where we have only two buttons. If I choose red, the whole color of the site changes to red. If I choose blue, it changes to blue. Now we have to find the flag from this website. This is the get ahead CTF challenge of Pico CTF. The description says, find the flag behind the server. Now since the name of the challenge is get ahead, I'm guessing we have to send a head request. So first let's copy the URL. In my terminal, type curl and paste the URL. And I can see the server responded me with the full content of the website. So this is a get request. With a get request, you can fetch full content from the server. But suppose instead of wanting the content, we want the metadata of the server and the content, like what type of a server it is and what type of a content it is. That's when we can send a head request. So with the curl command, if I specify dash capital I, it will send a head request. And I can see we get the metadata about the server and the content. The content type is a text HTML. And in the header response, I can see we also found the flag. You can send a head request with your verb suite too. So I'll first select my verb proxy, turn the intercept on of my verb suite and refresh the page. I can see we intercepted the request. So I'll right click and send this request to repeater. In the repeater tab, I can see we're sending a get request. I'll change this request to head and send the request. And I can see in the HTTP response from the server, we found the flag. So I'll copy this, paste it, click on submit, and we were correct. So that is for the end of the video. We're going over the web exploitation CTF challenges of Pico CTF. So if you want to follow along, please subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for watching.